are in Key Marco, only a couple of miles from the Marco Island famous Crescent Beach, world renowned, I might add, in this beautiful, opulent community that has over 546 acres to develop, and of which 375 of those acres are natural, never to be developed. There are 134 home sites in this beautiful community of Key Marco to be built or have been built on. And one of the coolest sections of this is, as you may be able to see on the right side of the car, as we get up to the top of the hill, is that they look out over Barfield Bay with magnificent views, some of which are about 46 feet above the water. Now, the interesting thing in Key Marco is it used to be call, called Whores Island. Now, that sounds a little weird, I might add, but it was named after Captain Whore, who was one of the first settlers in this area in Key Marco. And he had a pineapple plantation. Very, very cool. As a matter of fact, there's still an old home site here in this community of his first plantation or farm for the pineapple uh, plantation that he had. There's restrictions on what size of a home you can build. So 3,000 square feet under air is the minimum that you can put in this area. And there are also restrictions on how much foliage that you can take out to build your home. Key Marco is one of only two gated communities in all of Marco Island. Key Marco and Hideaway Beach. But this boasts a wonderful marina that Hideaway Beach doesn't have. Let's check it out. So can you imagine having a home in this amazing community with your own private dock with deep water access? Barfield Bay has about three feet of depth, but there's a channel that goes out this way to the Gulf of Mexico. And you get nature. This bird, she likes me. Don't tell her I told you. private community close to this beautiful Crescent Beach, one of very few in the world, with amenities galore, boat, gym, social room, etc. Look no further than Key Marco here on Marco Island.